Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we are going to learn the sum in machine drawing. First we will draw plus and we will start with all the circles. See this. This is point O. After that if you see there is a circle of diameter 18, 1, 8. So take a radius 9. Then there is a diameter 63. So the radius would be 30, 31.5. Then this radius 44, radius 56, this is given 30, 30 degree. So I will draw that first. See this 30 degree with vertical. Same way here also, 30 degree width vertical. So always remember whenever you start any machine drawing sum, first you draw a circle and all the angles. After that, we can draw this arc radius 56. This is let's say point A, this is point B. This is C and this is D. So I can draw arc radius 56. This is point A, B, C, D. So from point D, we have a radius 20. See this, all four circles and radius 12. So from point A, B, C, D, I can draw radius 20 and 12 like this, semicircle. Now see this is not there, that we will see afterwards. Now we have to draw this outside one. So from A to this, O to this point, we can draw R. Same way it will come down also. Then this radius. 12 inside one so you draw radius 12 from all these points A, B, C, D and then afterwards from O you can draw see this that radius 44 right all these radiuses we can draw from point O directly
this arc is also there After that, this radius 7, this is external, see this, it is touching this circle and this circle. So from here I need to cut 31.5 plus 7 and from here 20 plus 7, see. From O you cut 31.5 plus 7, that is 38.5 and from D you cut 20 plus 7 that is 27 so I will cut on all four sides because we have this radius 7 on all four sides and remember one thing they will give only once like over here in the main diagram they have given radius 7 only at one place but there are four places where we need to draw radius 7 so that you need to keep in mind after drawing this you can take radius 7 and you can draw R or you can do that method also from this point to O you can draw a line from this point intersection point to D so we'll get the exact point So this is P, Q, R, S. So from every pair, we can draw radius 7. Now we need to draw these two tangents also that we can draw directly. Now we can draw this hatching lines. The, all these lines are inclined at 45 degree and see I have done this scratch. So you can see the above video if you want to learn how to do this scratch. And after that you can draw these lines. The distance between these two lines would be somewhere around 2 to 3 millimeter. So you can draw 
all these hatching lines as shown in the figure. Thank you.